Hey, on today's video, I want to follow up with this install that we just posted last week. We just did a best practice install of this beautiful Marvin window with this Delta flashing system. And I want to show you why we don't tape the sills. And we're actually going to test this water from the inside as if 30 years from now, some water were to get by this window. And I'm going to show you how waterproof this install is. So let's pick this up on the inside. All right, so here's what we got. You can see here we framed this window with the cripple studs underneath on a five degree bevel. So the sill actually has some slope to it. It's beveled to the outside a little bit. And then if you watched last week's video, when we set this window, we did the waterproofing all the way to the inside. We set the window on a couple of horseshoe shims. So the window is not all the way down on the waterproofing, but it's up just the hair. This is actually an eighth inch shim right here. What we're gonna do is I cut a little slit in this water bottle. I'm gonna squirt some water on this sill as if this window had a leak. Now this is a Marvin, so this is not realistic to this window. These guys are make a phenomenal window, but 30 or 50 years from now, if this window did leak, or if another brand was used and had a leak, you can see we're just squirting a little water in there. Let's go see if that water comes out on the outside. Join me around the other side. All right, so check this out. I had one of the guys continue to squirt that water for me in that corner. Look how that's coming through right there. Now we nailed that flange tight against, but you can see even with that tight flange nail, it's water is just streaming right out of there. That's perfect, that's what we wanna see. Now we're gonna finish this off with a little Prosico air dam on the inside. We could also use some other types of caulking. We could use some Sega tapes, but we want this install to be totally airtight on the end. We want that back dam, but you can see with that slope sill, any water that gets in there, as long as we don't tape this bottom flange, that water is gonna run right out. This goes to show a perfect install like this is gonna keep the house dry for the life of the house, even if you have a window that either leaks from the start or leaks 50 years from now. See you next time.